Elias Devara with a quick Rosh Hashanah message. Let's dip the apple in the honey. What is the apple and what is the honey? The apple represents us and the various points in our lives where we feel different things. An apple is not permanent. Once you take a bite into that apple, it goes brown pretty quickly. You might be feeling yellow and mellow. Maybe you're feeling worn out and tired. Maybe you're feeling pretty and pink, like a pink lady apple, sweet on the inside. Maybe you look pretty and pink, but inside you're feeling bruised or rotting away. Or maybe there's a worm in there. Maybe you're in a really, really sour mood. So the apples represent the different kinds of parts of us and of our children. Sometimes we're in a good mood, sometimes we're having a hard day. All of that is not permanent. What is permanent? The honey. What is honey? Honey is something that is very pure. It's very pure and it's very permanent. Honey does not go bad. So what is the pure and what is the permanent of us? What is pure and what is permanent is the fact that we are good. The fact that we each have something to offer this world. The fact that we are doing our very best with the tools that we've got. And so when you're having that sour mood and you're having that moment and you think, I am that bad apple. You're not the bad apple. You're the honey. And sometimes, and your kids are the honey. And sometimes you need the reminder that that purity exists. You're having a yucky moment, but you're not a bad person. This might be a sour bite, but I can always coat it in honey. If you need the reminder, go and grab the honey that is undoubtedly somewhere, a permanent feature in your cupboard behind other, other items in your kitchen. Go and dip the apple in the honey. Because remember, intrinsically, inherently, what is the truth? That you are awesome, that you are good, that your children are awesome, that your children are good, and everyone is doing the very best. See you next time. Bye.